You know, guys, the youth and hunger in the locker room is going to explode in the ring tonight as we welcome everyone to NXT. And here's a superstar that has all the tools to be one of the biggest names this business has ever seen. I'm not ready to crown him as the next big thing just yet, but his performance in this match could sway me. You're not the only person to be looking to convince tonight. And with Johnny Gargano, you obviously have an undeniable talent with an unparalleled amount of drive and faith underneath his unparalleled amount of self-centeredness and high opinion of himself. You say that as though the latter shouldn't be informed by the former, Saxton. Everyone, including yourself, praises Gargano for his passion and heart inside the squared circle. I see no reason why he shouldn't also feel the same way about himself. Well, that's one way to leave the ring, I suppose. Moves outside. What's the plan here? Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. Don't do this. Don't do it! Spine-shattering impact. Two. Well, he's got him here. He's got him up. And go! Connects. And oh my God, what a forearm! That's a job. There's Gargano with a counter. Into the ring again. He may not be aware of the count. He's got to get back in. Makes it back just in time. Oof, that was really close. Time and time again, we've seen that there is no keeping Gargano down. How do you counter Johnny Wrestling's incredible stamina? It's true, Gargano doesn't know when to quit. So the best you can do is pile on as much damage as possible. Overwhelming force is the only way you might be able to keep Gargano down. He's looking a little out of balance. It's nothing he hasn't been through before. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, Cha-ching! Step up in Zaguri. And Gargano now with the edge. Johnny aggressively maintaining the advantage. Another trip to the skies, and it pays off once again. Into the corner he goes, a perfectly placed target. Oh, and that startles Johnny. Big punch to the body. Ooh. First one missed, second one didn't. Effective. Oh, uh, stop right there, gut. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Pain. Oh, look at his aggression, just oh, pure brutality. Come on, easy. Oh, he's got him here, he's got him up. And oh! He's going for the pin. This could be it. Into the pay window. No, stops the count at two. Almost inhuman at this point. Fireman's carry. Ground Gargano for good. And there's the win! Huge win here tonight! These gentlemen get after it. Here are the highlights. This is a big win for them here in a must-win match. Johnny Wrestling should change his nickname after a loss like that. That was embarrassing.
The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from New York, weighing in at 228 pounds, the Million Dollar Champion, the Superstar. Everyone in this match is competing at such a high level. I predict one of the most competitive matches we've seen in a very long time. Word is that the champ was actually asking for this to be a title match, but the officials backstage wouldn't allow it. That is how competitive he is. Prepare for the arrival of the most vicious, most vile, most violent competitor in Danny's opponent ring. from Huntington Beach, California, weighing in at 282 pounds, Samoa Joe. One of the baddest dudes to ever play the game. The first two-time NXT champion. A world-traveled, world-class competitor. One of the most well-rounded athletes sports entertainment's ever encountered. Well, the scenery may have changed in Samoa Joe's career, but the attitude is still the same. Samoa Joe does what he wants, when he wants. A very dangerous, dangerous man. Samoa Joe is much more than your average opponent. He's one of the most dangerous men you can face here in WWE. No question about it. Joe's a threat against anyone in this industry. Doesn't matter what plan you have or how talented you are. Joe is a living meat grinder who chews up his opponents and spits them out. Samoa Joe might get an early three count. One, two. And the show is up in time. That would have been a shocker. Packs a well-placed punch. Great job outthinking Joe. Sharp punch. Joe with some agility. Tell me, Corey, how do you counter someone like Samoa Joe, who weighs in close to 300 pounds but shows incredible athleticism inside the ring? Yeah, Samoa Joe's physicality makes him tough to beat, but you just might be able to wear him out. Take control of the pace. You might force Joe to the limits of his stamina. From the top. Just getting all twisted up. Oh, just tap out. Just tap out and end this thing. Luke, how do you get out of this? Oh, look at that. What a great counter. Oh, what a kick. Vicious. Ooh. Rolling elbow right on the mark. Taking on from the ropes. Just punched him right in the mouth. Oh, Relentless. God. Enough already. What a counter from Joe. Elbow drop. Piercing. He switches it back around. Oh, merciless knee to the face. Joe found himself in a dangerous situation there. Kick lands. Oh, a hard impact. 
in the corner. Look at this, going right after the left arm. Got to hurt. Oh, what a kick. Uh-oh. Face first in the turnbuckle. One, two. A series of kicks in the corner. Pat, that one's scouted.
the champion, and he's been a proud champion as well. Soaking it in from the, oh, look. Yeah, they want his championship. When you're the champion, there's always a target on your back. He wants that title all right. Settled in the ring. I can't wait. He's in perhaps the best physical condition of his life. He knows what it takes to reach the top here in WWE. And his opponent from Boston, Massachusetts, weighing in at 220 pounds, Carmelo Hayes. The WWE Universe is on their feet for this superstar. They are ready for unapologetic high intensity action. I would be shocked if we saw apologetic in-ring action of any sort, Byron. A guy who treats every match as if it's the biggest one of his career. He definitely plans to steal the show tonight. This superstar is coming in with a lot of enthusiasm and energy right now. But what's going to happen when the excitement wears off and he comes to realize he's in a fight against someone looking to take his head off? All I can say is we've seen adrenaline take this superstar very far in the past. But he'll be facing someone who has been looking for a challenging fight for quite some time now. Hopefully, he'll get it tonight. Headbutt! Oh, foot just stomping down. He avoids the damage. Kidneys. Cow, please. Nobody home. Belly to belly suplex. Right in the mouth. Oh, Relentless. God. Enough already. Wow, what agility. Oh, what's coming here? Submission move being applied. Right now, he's looking for any way to break out of this, and he does. Standing Spanish fly, are you kidding me? Incredible. Jarring impact. Well-placed kick. Off the turnbuckles. What's he gonna do? Uh-oh. Way too oh. Taking this match off the mat. From the heavens, big time splash. Taking a chance one more time and landing with incredible impact. All right, Hurricane Rana. He's stuck in his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Off the top. On a diving arm drag. Unbelievable athleticism. Second. Neck breaker! 
He's entered a state of distress now. He can't just think of riding this out. From the top. Oh, oh, the oh, it's a piercing elbow. from him here. We are looking at an unyielding attack from him. Off the top. Dummy arm drag. I like yours better, Cole. Consecutive high-risk maneuvers and the pace of this match has certainly picked up. Considered Cole, it's not a bad condition to be in at this point in the match. Well executed suplex. Watch. With the reversal. Tough position to be caught in here. He decides. Jeez. You can see. They're going to lock it in here. Camel clutch. Someone's getting humbled. I think he's got it locked in good. I just don't know how to counter this thing. I don't want to see him tap out. Not like this. He's risking permanent damage. And he lets him out of the submit. It could be over here. This is it. These guys feel no love for each other. Here's another look. one bad. Yeah, what a major win for him here. I don't care if it's your fifth victory or your 5,000th. As he's showing right now, nothing matters more here in WWE than having your name. Say what you want about Tommaso Ciampa's approach to in-ring competition. He's a man of conviction. He truly believes that he and he alone should be the standard bearer of this entire industry. self-confidence, Jenny predicament shoulders down. Really over zealous going with a pin attempt there. Hoisted, Hoisted all up. the way up. As the wrist trapped. And now a series of stomps and kicks. No, 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 break his arm. Vicious. He's returning fire. Oh, right to the kidneys. Champ is his competitive fire. He wants to win at any cost. And it can make him an intimidating opponent. If he can keep that fire burning throughout this match, I think he'll have a good shot at claiming victory. I think you're right, Corey. Champa's fire can also manifest in the form of some vindictive and savage attacks. shown there from Champa. He returns to the ring. Climbing up to him. He's got big play. Oh, look out. Whoa, look out. Big time risk. Pays off. The daredevil in you comes out when you take risks like that. 
something. This has been building for a long time, and it's finally going to break down right now, I think. You can really just feel the tension in the air. You're absolutely right. Elegant. I don't think we're going to have to wait much longer. Not at all. He's going to take the fight right to him. The official trying to prevent this from happening, but this is going to be bad. This is going to be really bad if it breaks down in the aisleway here. Let him fight. Let him fight now. Trash talking. Oh, there we go. Let him fight. Let him fight now. Oh!